you're happy and you know it, then your face will truly show it. If you're happy and you know it, do the floor. I love kids. They're just so fun and uh, full of energy and so full of excitement and wonder. I'm in many ways a big kid at heart. And so the kid in me, when I see them, it, it comes out and relates to the kid in them. There are just so few career choices that allow you to be a kid and to use and utilize the creativity that is on the inside you, that wonderment and that what if when we get to the age of being responsible for bills, there aren't too many opportunities for that. And so I'm glad that I get to do that. Groovy, he says. I love my brown shoes. I love my brown shoes. What I get to do here at the neighborhood house is share story times with the Child Care Development Center and the kids there. And it's always an awesome, fun, energizing time with the kids. And I, I love it because they just, every time I come, it's, they make me feel like a rock star. <laughs> <laughs> and so it, it's awesome. They just enjoy the books and songs and rhymes that I get to share with them. Working in children's services within the library, one of the main things that we get to do is to touch the community wherein our particular location is located. It's one of the favorite things that I get to do. It introduces children to books and the actual physical activity of going through a book and flipping through the pages and having that anticipation of what's on that next page and what's going to come next after this and what is that character going to face, what are they going to do, and it creates, I think, an appetite for reading. They get to learn words and get to learn about pictures that go with the story. I think it creates a building block that they can just continue to build on that goes really throughout their whole lives and hopefully creates that love for reading and that propels them into all aspects of their education. As with a lot of things, it's best to catch young folks early. Their minds are developing at a young age, at a very young age, and so they're able to take those things in. So I think when they get that kind of learning and get that kind of activity early, then it helps them as they grow to even absorb it more and absorb it more right. easily. So you guys want to help me with the Pete the Cat book? Yeah! Of the jobs that I've had, I really enjoy this one the most. A library can be an important cornerstone of a community. It allows patrons of all ages to have access to books, and items that they might not otherwise have access to. You're able to walk into a library and have the world at your fingertips. We do, I believe, affect people's lives for the good. And so it's a needed resource. Because it's all good. Yeah, he likes his shoes. He does like his shoes. When I bring the books and the kids are really excited, a lot of that has to do with that human interaction. It's really important because no matter how much technology develops, we've got to have relationships. Humans are social beings. So we've got to develop that interaction between each other. And so that's what I get out of my visits. Now's the time to say goodbye. I'll see you next time. All right. I'll see you.